what are we going to discuss appropriately on this wonderful family podcast, allegedly? Today. Family podcast. Today on Keeping the Deep Rose podcast, episode CinemaCon special, we've got random studios here, Paramount Pictures, WB, Sony Pictures, Disney something, something, something. All this and more in this episode. Stay tuned. This is the way. And pleasure Here's your host Keeping up with the Geek Bros All right 1 2 3 Yes 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 Keeping the Geek Bros podcast I'm vibe with me is man man we are the host of Keep it the Heroes Podcast, a family podcast, allegedly. Let's keep it going. So, what is going on and what is the happenings with us? I can't hear a goddamn thing. I'm taking this mask off. This is not the way. Oh my God. Woo! All right. I think you asked me what's going on with the Geek Bros. So, I'm just going to go from there. Look at my face. Nice. Uh, check it out. All the ways. This is the way, after all. It's the um, maps. So, um, I don't know. Is it me or you? Talk again? You sound a little so muffled. That, that's the match right there, buddy. Oh, dude, you're here. Your sound is muffled. Let's, let's uh let's, let's let's tighten that up. What are you talking that's, about, bro? That's much better. All right. Okay. So what's going on, Geek Bros? Well, we have completed the Ready Player Geek Bros <coughs> run of season one, I guess. All 12 episodes. So episode five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I only wrote up to nine. But we've got Power, uh, Power Wash Simulator, T- Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, uh, number number seven fail, Overcooked uh, Part One and Part Two. That's eight, and nine, uh, ten was something, and eleven was definitely Nobody Saves the World Part One and Two. Ten and eleven, check it out. It's a lot of fun, actually. When I edited those, uh, and I mean barely edited, but when I edited those videos. It just was hilarious. A lot of stupid shit that we said in these things, and it was a lot of fun. Actually, I don't know if you realize one of them got struck for not being for not, not it needs to be 18 or above i don't know if you knew that yeah one of the episodes of of, of um uh nobody saves the world s- said hey your content has been flagged as 18 and above nobody under 18 can watch it uh period like flat and i was like oh that's never happened before i say something bad i mean it's us. <laughs> I haven't rewatched the episode to see what it is. But if you want to see the episode where YouTube is banned for 18 or, or, or younger, then check it out. It's episode one of them. I don't know. I think it's 11 or 12. But one of them is banned. Not banned. Is, is restricted to 18 above. Because it is not family friendly. Because we are not a family podcast after all. All right, Jim. not. So what are you geeking about this week? Uh, honestly, I don't know. Because... I just finished moving, so I'm trying to get all that situated first. So I'm very anti geek this week. Um, there's a movie or something this, coming this, out or something. This coming from the man that that said, <clears throat> "Record some geek bros right now." Listen, man, I'm just trying to get content out for our lovely, lovely viewers that are out there. So are they it, out there? Are they really? Somebody's out there. I, I would have given up on us. <laughs> I would have given up on us two or three reboots ago. Uh, that's because you know you just you just don't like people that's not my like i don't like geek bros fuck this they lost their way (laughs) i lost it is definitely a truth but we're good we're we're here we're something fix your goddamn audio what oh god now now you lost it completely i don't know i don't know what you want me to do what do you want me to do here okay i don't i don't know it just sounds so it's like it's you, you sound like you're talking like this I'm not even close to my mic. It's right there. Jesus Christ. That's okay. All right. All right. Forget it. Forget that I even said anything. (laughs) Forget I even said anything. Okay. Um, I'm forgotten. uh, Me. me, I'm geeking out this week on Babylon 5, actually. I'm watching Babylon 5. It is such an old show. I mean, oh, my God. Um, 
geeking when I said we're geeking out on it, about it, I'm giving it the 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 Mad Man three episode stamp. I'm on episode two right now to see if I can get into it because I heard some good things about Babylon Five, and I finished Farscape and they said it was way better than Farscape. So I said, okay, let me check it out. So I'm actually geeking out on that. I'm also geeking out on holy shit, Spider Man Across the Spider Verse. Holy shit. Um, I don't want to say too much because we're not re- reviewing it on this episode. And I do want to do original recipe uh, and a hot take on this thing. But my God, if you've not seen that movie, go watch that movie. It it It's great. I want to see it again. I just haven't had a chance. I was going to go today, but I'm feeling kind of under the weather. I look kind of, you know, I look handsome pale. But definitely, definitely geeking out mm. about, about, nobody asked you. Definitely geeking mm. out about into the Spider-Verse. So definitely check that out. Uh, it's 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 amazing. So without further ado, episode Cinema Con special one. What part one? What I don't know. Starts now. But first, subscribe to our podcast whenever it comes out. Leave a review whenever you listen, and share with your friends if they care. If you uh, have friends, if you have friends, uh, <laughs> it's the right thing to do. Uh, there's no fresh scent. There's no uh, what's new in the gaming world. We're jumping directly into Cinema Con. And you know how we do. Wow, that's a lot of fucking episodes. Oh, damn it. Um, so I just looked. I am actually looking at the outline right now. That is a lot of shit. Um, we're, just, we're not doing it all right now. Well, okay, so part one. So yeah. we're, we're jumping right into Madman's side piece. You know the deal. He's going to share his screen. Uh, allegedly, the man pre downloaded the video. So we're not going to see any, any of those uh, YouTube random shits. So let's see what happens. And you know what you forgot to do? We forgot to share the screen so I could fix the, sc- the screen before. We did. We did no, we didn't. Yeah, so it's okay. So share the screen when you're ready. I'll fix it on, you know. Look, this is behind the scenes. We don't do this very often anymore, okay? You're welcome. Oh, you, you, you got to give me permission. <laughs> Damn, this happens all the time. How do I do this again? Multiple advanced sharing <laughs> options. Oh, all oh that's funny. All participants. There it is. You're good to go. Okay, ready? Sharing. Um, I love snap. it when you share your screen. <clears throat> it should be uh-huh. that one. Oh yeah, nope. and then we do sound and then share that. All right, now let me fix. Oh, there gosh. you go. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Wait, wait. I'm waiting. Here bro. we are. All right, I'm waiting. I'm ready whenever you are. Um, that's very cool. We love your desktop, by the way. Oh yeah, your post attendee and your progressive log and your tech notes. Hey, hey, that's very sophisticated work, there, buddy. I'm not saying um, it is. I'm just saying you, you, you. We don't need a peek behind all that curtain. Okay, so wait. Um, uh-huh. What is the first one we're doing? Uh, I, I, right. You tell me. <clears throat> is a Bad Boys Four coming out? Is yeah. a trailer for Bad Boys Four coming? There's out? There's not a trailer, but it's coming out. Um. All right, so I'm just gonna go through some of the stuff that they have here um they made announcements on the sony we're going to do the first two days and the second two days after that or the next time we record um so that'll be next month no it'll probably be more um so they announced that bad boys 4 is being recorded so this is the sony pictures um should i move this out of the way does it matter uh, I, i'm not sure what you mean by this but this uh, so now you can see that full screen there, All right? Well, maybe make it maximum, ma- maxim, maximize it. I did. That's maximized. Yeah. Why do I see so much of your desktop? Are you still over there? <laughs> All right. How about that? That uh, yeah. <clears throat> okay. I don't, so, mean, I don't know if our viewers are want to show our viewers how shitty our outline looks, but cool. I mean, I mean, okay. I could just stop sharing, Pam. No, don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyways. <laughs> <laughs> God, we're horrible at this. Um, videos, movie trailers. So, uh, the 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 da 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 da. Um, what am I doing now? Fantastic. Oh, wrong. Okay, so, uh, first day of CinemaCon is the Sony Pictures. They announced. They made a bunch of announcements. I'm not going through everything. I'm not making. I didn't take notes on what they're doing and whatever. Just gonna put the announcements out there. So they announced. Bad Boys 4 is, uh, I believe it's begun filming. Uh, They're making a movie called Dumb Money, which is about uh, the GameStop uh, scandal with the... uh, Oh, you mean that scandal? You you mean uh, that that Robin Hood thing? Yeah, yeah, the the Robin Hood and the, the, what do you call it? The... um, 
uh, the, the, short, the short sellers. Yeah, the short stuff. sale and that whole Reddit thing or whatever. So yeah. they're making a movie based on that. Um, we already did a trailer review for Insidious, the Red Door. I don't remember that. Yeah, it was like the last episode or the one before that. Um, oh, la- the last year was there. No, not last year. Shush. Um, the, the Machine. I don't know if we did that. No, we didn't. So, yeah, we'll go ahead and start with that. Uh, I think now we're going to jump into trailers because they made a few announcements, but I'm going I'm going in and out because I'm a special individual. Um, oh, shit, they're making a Ghostbusters 2? After, yeah. after Life 2? After Life great. 2. Great. Yep. Um, where am I here? The oh, Equalizer 3. Isn't he old? He is, but, you know, what are you going to do? Um, some oh. of these movies, since we're doing this super late, some of these movies already came out. <laughs> so we apologize. But this will be our first time watching the trailers. <laughs> Uh, yeah, you'll get you'll get uh, our I reaction. Hate, I hate your audio. What? I don't know what's going Gosh. on with my audio. Shh, 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 shh. Like, I okay. didn't. It'll be okay. I didn't it'll do okay. anything. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. No, I'm tired of this. You talking to me it? like what? What is it? Is it plugged into a, a USB or is it? A yeah, it's a USB. Okay. Maybe, um, maybe you have the mic volume up too loud. Maybe that's what it is. Because your you audio seems like it's overblown. That's what it does. It sounds like it's overblown. Okay, so is, does this sound better now? No. No? How about now? No? no. Okay, maybe this button? How about now? No, that's okay. Oh, uh, okay, whatever. I give up on you. Um, Say something. <laughs> Faja, can you hear me? Um. All right, so I need... Where's this window? Why I can't see this window? Movie trailers. Oh no, not this one. Yep. I, want... I love doing this podcast. It's like it's so thrilling, exciting. Wait, what just happened? What's what 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 happened now? <clears throat> I want you to know we're actually live. No, not I live. know, we're but live. we're recording. But this yeah. is like it's there's something going on with my computer now. Uh huh. Um. Okay. So. So. I thought I had this open. You need me to do something, or no? I'm I'm getting it going. It's going. I love what it keeps going. It's going. You see, I... you know what? I feel bad for the people who are watching who are watching this because I'm not going to edit any of this out, and I feel bad for those who are listening to this because I'm not editing any of this out. Why? Because Geek Bros Podcast, much like all my parts, is a drag and drop show. I record it. I don't edit much of it because I don't have the time, um, or the patience, or the disposition. Or, or the discipline to edit it. So all of this is being dragged and dropped. This is your kids. Oh, that's the picture. <laughs> Why does she look so sad? You yelled at her before I took a picture, huh? No. Wait, how can we see that screen? All right, do you know. see this screen now? I see it's black. Okay. Black I, like I, don't, I don't know why I did that. All right. So first trailer we're gonna watch is called The Machine, starring one of I my love favorite comedians. The time machine. Uh Bert Kreischer and Mark Hamill. I love Mark Hamill. So ready? Oh no, wait. Do you see all that other stuff on there? Yeah. You I do. just see. What are you doing? I just see the black screen. Hold on. This doesn't. I'm. Me. I'm going to kill you. We are literally recording. <laughs> I think you're literally shorting out my 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 screen. Like. I'm, I'm giving you seven years ago. Okay, here we go. One incredible story blew up the internet. When I was 22, I got involved with the Russian Mafia. Maximize it. Class trip. This is Igor. He's here for your protection. He is very dangerous. Ooh. You are not to talk to or hang out with him. All I want to do is hang out with him. I did not speak Russian. Yeah, I'm a machine. <laughs> All I knew how to say was, On the machine! It was literally the best summer of my life. We robbing this guy? This is Russia! 23 years after those events, the story continues. What is wrong with this shirt? <laughs> Yo, machine. Uh, not today, brother. Not today. My dad showed up. You paid money to see my son tell his made-up story about robbing a train in dad, Russia? For the millionth time, it's a true story. It took about two seconds before he started making me mental. Look at him. Hey, He's a monster. <laughs> Ma'am, the party's outside. 23 years ago, you stole the only thing my father ever cared about. Sorry. This is some sort of TikTok prank? I'm about to lose my shit. It's definitely a prank. Clearly, that's a fake gun. <laughs> or not. You're coming with me back to Russia. Russia? Yeah. 
If you try to run. Oh. He's, he's going down. Dad, why are you talking all fast like you're on speed or something? Because I'm on speed. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Bird. No, this is the last Jedi I'm talking about. And show those SOBs who you really are. Now? You gotta party with me. He's the motherfucking machine! Fine. Oh, we're just gonna shoot him in the leg. Okay. Oh. Oh my god! I'm going to fucking hell! I killed a man. Well, technically you killed several men. <laughs> All right, so we're going to stop it right there. We're going to give our hot take on the machine. I love my podcast voice. Man, man, what do you think about the machine? Uh, I, I definitely want to see this movie. This is something that I definitely want to watch because I love Burt Kreischer. And who doesn't want to see Mark Hamill in something else? <laughs> I agree. I agree. Um, it seems interesting. Uh, I think because I, I, I don't know how much Mark Hamill's been in. I mean, yeah, besides the Star Wars, is is I remember he was in Jane Silent Bob Strike Back, and like that was funny too when he was cock knocker. So I love seeing him in non Star Wars roles. So right. I, I, I'll definitely check this out. Uh, it's a funny trailer. Uh, it's just one of those stupid comedies. I'm not really into stupid comedy, but I'll check it out because anything for Mark. Of course, anything for Mark. Anything for Mark. Um, all right. Let me. You do, you do know that when we while we're doing our review, you can switch to the next one. So, so yes, 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 right. yes. I know. That's why I move the window over so I can see what I'm doing, keeping track here. Okay. Is that is that what you're doing? Off my back, sir. I got this. I was just just making sure that you know this is flows. I mean, you know, I want I want our audience to think that we are professionals, even though we're not. We're really not. I'm I'm not a professional at anything. But I don't want them to think we're really that amateur. We're four or five years into this podcast. This is a- I'm only three years into it. Um, anyways, so yeah, so there was another announcement. Damn, I should have put all this together. Sorry, my bad. There was another announcement called Any Anyone But You. I couldn't find a, a trailer for it or anything. I don't know anything about the movie, but it was announced. I, again, am horrible. I've been going through a lot with my move and stuff and i just i wrote a bunch of stuff down but i didn't take any notes uh the I, next I, I think your your the, your this, the vibe from your move is like just oozing through your audience. it's just it's just shut up all right so the next trailer is grand turismo turismo the movie turismo if you miss a line in the game you reset oh yeah miss it on the track you could die yes who do you think the best driver is probably rory i would dust him in a lap Oh. All you do is play video games with some crazy dreams of racing cars. That's what means that. That is what means that. You know what racing cars cost? <laughs> Look around. It's not our world, son. <laughs> what is this? This is a contest. This is a PlayStation movie. <laughs> Hilarious. The best <laughs> Gran players in the world get a chance to compete in professional. Oh, this, this is based on a true story, right? I have no idea. I, I know oh. it's based on the game. This is real. No. Clearly, but I, I swear I heard this is based on a true story. You're going to take a kid who plays video games in their bedroom. You're going to strap him to a 200 mile an hour rocket. It'll tear him to pieces. This is like the new Cool Runnings. You can't hate me now. It's not going to work. The guys who race are elite athletes. But I want stars. Your kids are scrawny. I'm not a car guy. Really? No, no. Come on, let's go. Stop now. Must be a new experience for you moving your legs. <laughs> you puked on my lawn. There's no turning back now. When you're in a race, racing cars, how is it going to be? You're going to be 140 degrees Fahrenheit. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I don't understand. G forces will be twice what an astronaut experiences upon liftoff. I can't see anything. Yes. Yeah. Hey, you get extra points for that in the game? Jesus Christ. <laughs> This whole thing is insane, but out of the couch surfing nerds that you sent me, he is the best one. You made it. Yes! Welcome to Team Nissan. What's next? The major leagues. The other drivers are going to hate you. Come on. Ooh. Oopsie. Dude, what is your problem? It's part of the game. It's called racing. But I won't stop now. If you miss a line in the game, you reset. You miss it on the track. <laughs> You could die. Ooh. 
It's all about family. Emily, I've raced yeah. it a thousand times. Oh, one last ride. That's what I'm talking about. See, it is based on a true story. I knew it. So, like, there's a story that, like, this sort of kind of happened. Like, a video gamer got behind the wheel of a, of a thing. I think I saw like an interview with the guy, the guy, the real guy. And that's yeah, okay. And I and I and, and from what I saw, the real driver that's this story is based upon he's the stunt driver in the movie so the real guy this is based upon is doing the stunt driving in this movie a, a movie about him as interesting so yeah I, I remember hearing so that. the the story is based on the stunt driver no no he he's the real driver yeah but yes he's, he's that's what the, i just said <laughs> yeah i know i know but he's not a stunt driver he's just doing the stunt driving for this movie Right. He's a real graduate, right? But he's gonna be the, he's the stunt driver in the movie, and it's the real guy that the movie's about. It's really interesting. So I I like the concept of it. Um, I think I'm gonna check it out. I do know that you know the offsprings that kind of they might be interested in going to go see it, uh, or I might just wait for it. But it is interesting. I will see it somehow, somewhere. I just can't guarantee I'm gonna run to the theaters to see it unless I see it in like one of those Dolby screens where it's like big, because this is like a uh, movie that needs to be big, very big. Yes, you like it big? I like it big, yeah. yeah I know you do. Uh, that's what she said. <laughs> um, moving along. Family podcast. I I don't I'm not I you know what, bro? Like Dom Dom screwed it for me, bro. I don't like family anymore. <laughs> it's not about family for you anymore? No, bro, it's not about family for me how you, anymore. How do, you, how do you feel about physics and the laws of nature? Um I am at one with my inner self. Amen. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> Hey man, bro. Hey. What's next? What we got going on? So the the next trailer. Hey, did you did you didn't review it? Did you review it? What do you, what do you think about Gran Turismo? I mean, I never really got into the game itself. I've never but, played the game once. Yeah, I've never played the game once myself either. But the, last uh, the trailer game, looked interesting. The last racing game I played, <laughs> showing my age, was Daytona USA on the Sega Saturn. <laughs> wow, that was the last. Last video racing game I've ever played. Back when I didn't, I played every game on the, on the sun. Now I just play JRPGs, and I mean retro JRPGs. Um, so yeah, that's the last video game, the last racing game I ever played. Yeah, yeah that's that's sad, son. It is sad. Oh, it what is just sad. happened? What's happening now? Uh, I don't know. My whole my whole thing just oh, there we go. It just it just died. Excuse me. My window just crashed. How does my window hate crash? Me now. But I won't, I won't stop, stop now. now. Right. You can hate me now. Oh. Trying, to, trying to get it to come back up. There we go. That's what she said. She never says that to me. I mean, wait, what? That's, that's a goddamn lie. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So the next trailer is Equalizer Trace. Uh, is there a real trailer for that? Yes. They why, can't actually... they, why, can't they, why can't they do the Book of Eli too? Yeah, that was a great movie. Oh my god, Man, that was really good. That was a really that great movie. Shit, I'm saying. All right, uh, Equalizer three loading and one hundred percent. There was chapters. Is this his version of John Wick? I guess. I guess the other way around, huh? I've never seen any of the other movies, so this is meaning to me. Oh, it's a, it's a pretty good series. Nine seconds. Oh, it, looks, so it still looks good. That's what I'll give you to decide your fate. Ciao, Roberto. Roberto, tell me, what did you do back home? Government work. I'm retired, man. Who are you? Who is that? My Benny. <laughs> because of these people, I'm beginning to understand real people. Oh. And I'm starting to believe. This is where I'm supposed to like be. Cinema Paradiso. What happens to you happens in many towns. The mafia. They're like cancer. No cure. Yeah, other people's wow. business. Whatever it is, you and your friends do, do it somewhere else. 
house. You warning me? I'm preparing. <laughs> Is that a Timex? No, it's a boot. Ah! Oh, yes. I'm nerve, but I'm compressing. Ah! That's a level three. Ah. I wanted to go to a level four. Ah! <laughs> I felt that shit. Ouch. You seem like a man who understands violence. I like this place. You can't take that from me. I can take anything I want. Police found multiple dead bodies on that farm in Sicily. Did you kill him? Nine seconds. Do I look like a killer? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look, that trailer was it was hot. I liked it. I again, I don't know anything about this series. I never watched a single one of them. So, will I watch this? No. Do, am I interested in watching the other the other two? No. But it was a hot trailer. It, it entertained me. Mad Man. Uh, I watched the other two movies. Definitely on board with this one. Um, especially if it's going to close out the deal. Um, funny story. What 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 was her name? I forgot her name. God. Uh, Mila Kunitz. No, not that one. Uh, that's not her. Mila Jovovich. Bitch. No, no, you see, now you're just making stuff up, and I don't like that. But I, don't know, but I have no idea who you're referring to, so, so how, how am I supposed to help? Uh, Dakota Fanning, that's her name. She was in the original um, as a child. That's how That's how far back this goes. Okay. She was she was a child. Now you see her as a full grown adult talking that to him at the, the other Yes. I didn't recognize her at all. That's what I'm saying. She was a child um, when when she was in the, the the movie was basically based on her. Like she was kidnapped or some something. I'm probably wrong, um, but I think she was kidnapped. I don't remember. So, but but it, but it says this is the final chapter. Is this a, is this like a John Wick kind of like situation that yes. builds upon itself? Yes. In a um, sense. Okay. It doesn't sound like it, but you have not convinced me. But all right, no dead air, no dead air. Sorry, I'm I'm being summoned. What does that mean? Nothing. I'm ignoring people. I don't um. So, Paradiso. which which one are we doing here? Oh, okay, Sony. So I'm so sorry, guys, that I let this happen the way this is going down. But I just, I just don't. Care. I apologize, man. I'm, I'm trying to just, you know, get my stuff together here. All right. So uh, there was a movie, another movie announced called Napoleon by Ridley Scott. Uh, well, what just happened? That was weird. Um, it's going to be released uh, November twenty second, twenty twenty three. I have yet to find a what do you call it? A trailer. I haven't found a trailer for it yet, but as soon as I find one for it, I will definitely put it out there, like I do with everything else. Um, next trailer will be uh, Spider Man Across the Spider Verse. Should we? I know that's right. Should we watch it? Because you know, it's already you've already seen it, but whatever. I guess we can watch it. It's loading. Uh, 3, 10, 14, 39, 43, 84. Bam, there it goes. Ready? Boom. Yeah. Uh, you want it. My name is Miles Morales. I'm Brooklyn's one and only Spider-Man. And things are going great. Oh, yeah. You were supposed to be here. Bye. All right, whatever. Whatever? Wow. Whatever? So are you like a cow or a Dalmatian? I am the spot. <laughs> That's not funny. Don't, don't do that. Miles's grades are pretty good. A in AP Physics. That's my little man. And a B in Spanish. What? Ooh, okay. Miles. Are you trying Mira, to kill me? Mira, that's what I gotta go. All right, okay, bye. He's lying to you. And I think you know it. <laughs> Want to get out of here? And that soundtrack oh, is wait. banging for this one, too. So wait a minute. There's an elite crew with all the best spider people in it? Uh, who's the new guy? This is unbelievable. This is the lobby. 
Miguel O'Hara. The whole thing was his idea. What's a guy gotta do to join this spider team? Oh, man, I gotta get out of here. I gotta watch these videos. Don't even get me started on Doctor Strange and the little nerd back on Earth 1999-99. Come on, go easy on the kid. He had a terrible teacher. Peter. Miles. Mayday. You have a baby? I have a baby. I'll take it from here. Miles, being Spider-Man is a sacrifice. Isn't that danger? So you know who Spider-Man 2099 is, right? The big guy? So I know, I know who he is present, who he was presented as in the movie. I don't know, but real no, name. but do you know who does the voice? I can do both. Oh yeah, that's Oscar Isaac. Yeah, always. not always. What about? I thought that was crazy. If not for Uncle Ben, most of us wouldn't be here. Can't stop me now. You can't run forever, kid. I can't lose one more friend. Yourselves isn't what we talked about. You knew? I had no idea what you're doing. Everyone keeps telling me how my story is supposed to go. Nah, I'm gonna do my own thing. Woo! Stations, stop Spider-Man. You? You know what? Me? <laughs> <laughs> I think that was great that they put that in there. And I looked at my uncle and... Uh, let me guess. He died? Listen. Listen to me. Listen to me. Everything that that trailer showed you is all real. It's all true. Let me tell you something right now. This movie, I mean, it for me, it's better than the first. It is so good. It is long, but it's but but it's long to where you don't want it to end. And when it gets close to the end, you're like, please don't let it end here. Please don't let it end here. Please don't let it end here. The art styles are ridiculous. The characters are ridiculous. The story is ridiculous. Look. My God. All right, let's, let's look at it this way. I'm going to change this way. All right. And you guys know me, man. I'm, I'm, I'm the worst critic when it comes to movies. Okay. I, I will do anything to put on my mesh shirt and my, and my little Fisher hat. The movie was no more than 10 to 12 minutes in. I turned to my son and said, This movie is the shit. In 10 to 12 minutes, I turned to my youngest and said, Yo, this movie is the shit. And that's what I said. And I said it to him like four times throughout the movie. This movie is the shit. I'm going to go watch it. He's probably like, shut up. <laughs> no, listen, he probably is. I was so, at the end of the movie, I, I yelled, whoa! Like, that's how, that's how jacked up I felt. This movie was that, that good. That is my most favorite and the best Spider movie. And it, it, it eclipses Far From Home. I thought Far From Home was my, was my favorite. I mean, no, that's, that's like, that's puppy love compared to this. I'm full blown. This is, this movie is my soulmate kind of feel. Sorry. Trailer. Go. Awesome. I love it. Uh-huh. So yeah, like I was saying, Mad Man is currently uh rolling his eyes uh for those who are not watching us. Uh so back to my 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 hot take. It's a great movie. And I want to review it all day every day. I want to do like a five-part special breaking it down for Geek Grows original recipe series. Are you are you is your audio back? What's up? I'm I'm doing filler right now. Yeah, it's back. Okay. But I right, gotta so, pause it. All right, we and we gotta pause it. We'll be right back, suckers. Geek Bro, CinemaCon special, Vibe and Man Man. That's it, we're back. And we're going to continue on with Man Man's review of Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse with Clever. Yeah, that's horrible. Don't ever do that again. No one hears you. Um, so, yeah, I definitely want to see the movie. Um, I actually might be available this coming weekend to watch it. So we can finally do a review since I have a lot more free time on my hands now, surprisingly, and it sucks my life, but whatever. Um, so, yeah, I've, I wanted to watch it ever since I f it was first announced. So we're, we're, we're already beyond that. Listen, you let me know when you're ready. I mean, unfortunately, guys, there's work being done at the, uh, at the house, which is, of course, where the studio is based. So doing a, an original recipe video won't happen here well it probably could but it would look terrible but but definitely we definitely can go and check it out and then give the review on the podcast uh, when, when we record again in two months so definitely definitely an idea yeah whatever two months uh so uh that being said uh What's up, danger uh they also announced there was also an announcement for ghostbusters afterlife part two um there, there's no release date, but they did show a some footage, set footage, of um, 
Paul Rudd, Finn Wolford, Carrie Coon, and McKenna Grace in their Ghostbuster uniforms, leaning against the Ecto-1 vehicle. What's so, up, Danger? So it, it, it is coming. Um, another, another announcement they made is the movie Kraken, which is set to be released in theaters October 6th. They released a two-minute teaser trailer. Um, What's up, Danger? No, of course. Craven the Hunter, the Sony's Craven. Oh, I thought you said Kraken. No, Craven. Uh, Craven, sorry. Craven the Hunter will be Sony's first R-rated Marvel movie, um, and it will be, like I said, released. It's set to release October sixth this year. They showed a two-minute teaser trailer to the attendees of CinemaCon. They have not publicly released it as of yet, so there's no leaks. No, there's no le- I mean, there's leaks, but they look like crap, and I'm not even gonna bother doing that because oh. it's just it's just really bad looking. Um, yeah, so it's 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 danger. What's up? Um, and that's it for day one of the Sony Pictures segment for CinemaCon. That's day, day one of CinemaCon Sony Pictures. Day two, we will jump into day two. CinemaCon Sony Pictures starts now. Warner Brothers, Warner Brothers, Warner Brothers, Warner Brothers. Why do I keep getting this O snap? Stop telling me O snap and do what I want you. There you go, you stupid computer. I'm sorry, guys. Something's wrong with my computer today. Um, so Warner Brothers, Warner Brothers, Warner Brothers, Warner Brothers. Uh, they made an announcement for something called Furiosa, which is the Mad Max prequel. Nobody's gonna watch that. Um, I didn't even watch Mad Max, so I can give two craps about that. Um, where is the info on it? I didn't watch. I didn't watch uh, Mad Max Fury Road, but I did watch the making of it. And that was freaking awesome. It looked like a lot of fun and also very dangerous. I mean, they're out in the desert, man. It's, it's hard to do. Um, but yeah, I didn't. I don't. Where the hell? Whatever. I don't have any information on that because I can't find it. And I'm just looking through this really quick, and I don't really care. This is a great episode. Um, guys. Great episode. So next thing that they got here is uh, Beetlejuice two. They announced is coming. Um, what, do you, what do you mean by Beetle? What do you, what do you, what do you mean? The movie Beetlejuice with uh-huh. um, Michael Keaton. They are making a part two. Is he? He's like a, some kind of weird renaissance going on now, huh? Doesn't he? Right. So but it is in development. He's hot all of a sudden. It is in development and it is also starring Jennifer Ortega or Ortega, sorry, from the movie Scream Five, Six, whatever it was that came out, and uh, Wednesday the series on Netflix. Um, I don't think they have anybody else. Oh, I think uh, Winona Ryder's coming back, um, but they really haven't put too much. Uh, details out there for this movie so i apologize there's really nothing that i can do about that um they also showed a logo for the you know uh james gunn's you know take on the new superman legacy movie that he wants to put out all they did was put a logo so i guess that's some sort of excitement um yeah do i have the logo no 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 we don't care Okay. Uh, they also put a logo out for uh, the, a new Final Destination movie because I, I thought love they were Final Fantasy. I said Destination, not Final Final Fantasy. Um, I thought they were done making these movies, but apparently they're not. So yeah, uh, they also announced the Conjuring, uh, which they are you know making more of the. They're expanding the universe. They're creating the next movie is going to be called The Last Rite. I and they love also, the Conjuring cinematic universe. And they also announced that there will be a series at some point. Um, oh, God, do I really got to watch this? Okay, whatever. Um, the next trailer we're going to watch is Barbie. Do you want to watch Barbie? Yeah, go for it. Because isn't Margot Robbie in it? She is. So, yes. I, will watch, I will watch anything. Okay. And Ryan Gosling. That's my. Okay. That's my I don't dude. give a shit. I will, <laughs> I, I'm waiting to pre order her bath water. Like, it's, it's serious. Well, just, just get her farting up in a in a jar, bro. It's good. No, no, no. Anyways, you can you can spread that out more often. Oof, spreading. Anyways, um, here we go. <laughs> uh, and bam, it didn't go. There it is. Yes. Hey, Barbie. Why is she so beautiful? Can I come to your house today? Sure. I don't have anything big planned, just a giant blowout party with all the Barbies and plant choreography and a bespoke song. You should stop by. So cool. You can find me under the 
Oh, okay. That's too loud, should I know it? This is the best day ever. It is the best day ever. So is yesterday, and so is tomorrow, and every day from now until forever. Do you guys ever think about dying? Whoa. <laughs> it was dark. When my heart breaks. Some things have been happening that might be related. When my world shakes. Cold shower. Ooh. Falling off my roof. <laughs> and my heels are on the ground. <gasps> oh my gosh, she's so fine. Whoa. What's going on there? There's a lot to take in. To do. You have to go to the real world. You can go back to your regular life, or you can know the truth about the universe. The choice is now yours. The first one, the high heel. You have to want to know, okay? Do it again. Closer, I am fine. <laughs> okay. Wow, this is the real world. <laughs> What's going on? Why are these men looking at me? Yeah, they're also staring at me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm so sorry. In the real world, that's impossible. If this got out. This He's be... Holy yes. shit, I didn't even know he was in there. Catastrophic! We haven't played with Barbie since we were like five years old. Oh. No one rests until this doll is back in a box. Even if nobody else sings along. Humans only have one ending. Get that Barbie! Ideas live forever. I'm absolutely watching this. No, I won't let you do just one appendectomy. But I'm a man. But not a doctor. Can I talk to a doctor? You are talking to a doctor. Can I need a clicky pen? No. A sharp thing? No. There he is. Doctor! Somebody get security. <laughs> it's Bobby Boots if you're still in doubt. All right. All right. Absolutely. I don't know. That was fun. What do you think? That was fun. I'll, I'll watch that. I'll absolutely watch that. That was a lot of fun. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna lie to you. That's the first time I saw the trailer, and Me too. Um, and uh, yeah, that actually seemed pretty interesting to me. That looks like a lot of fun. I mean, I'm not interesting for me, but I just looks like it looks like a good time, and that's really all. It, it's got it's it screamed in the beginning. I was like, oh, this is like a Lego movie, but uh, it it want like I said, Margot Robbie, shit, like, Jesus Christ. Um, but after, but beyond that, this seems fun. It seems fun, and we all deserve a little bit of fun in our life. So yeah, I like I like fun. Out. I'm checking this out. So we're going to watch this. We're going to put on wigs. We're going to do a, a parody Geek Girls episode. What do you think? Parody yeah. Geek Girls? Because this is absolutely a Geek Girls episode. Now, Geek Girls, for those who don't know, was a spinoff that lasted, I think, four, five episodes before it kind of like just fizzled out. Uh, so, yeah, I think we should do like a like a, like a, a parody. I have wigs. Put on a wig. You know, you can be one of the characters. I'll be one of the characters. Because we'll, we'll, we can't review this shit. Like, it's not a Geek Bros thing. Um, um, I mean, we could. Why yeah, wouldn't that's, we? That's what I I'm mean, talking about. What? I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not worried about my sex, my, my sexuality. No, I, that's not what I'm saying. That's not what I'm saying. I divide these, these kind of things were reserved for the Geek Girls brand. The Geek Girls brand technically doesn't exist anymore. So okay, why not so... Send, it, send it out with, with a bang by dressing up as the Geek Girls and just saying, hey! Um, Because we could probably potentially get canceled for that. So... You know, one, we don't have that reach for our audience. <laughs> Listen, funny. all it takes is one person, bro. All it takes is one mic. All it takes is one person, and then that's it. We're done. Um, so moving on, um, what do I have here? I'm having issues here. Geek girls that's, coming. That's at what you. I'm having. Um, oh my god, my, you my guys shit. should watch the Geek Girls. The Geek Girls is a fun little spinoff. It actually began with like a fake. I don't know how I came up with this idea. I think, I think the former host co-host of the show um the artist formerly known as wancho and the artist formerly known as dark star flex they um their significant others wanted to be involved because we were doing a lot of geek boys geek, geek boys geek bros stuff 
And I'm just killing time while Madman gets the next the next. I got one. it. Oh, well, that's the end of that. Check it out. <laughs> so, a couple of the more announcements that they made. <laughs> um, I, I'm sorry. I guess. It's filler. It's filler. I was just um, no dead air. They announced Hugh Grant is going to be playing an Oompa Loompa in the Willy Wonka prequel, which will be starring, um, what's his name? What's his name? No. uh, God, what is his name? Is this connected to any of the other remakes or is this a brand new thing? Uh, Let me see. Shows Willy Wonka making chocolate. It'll be more of a musical of sorts. Uh, the trailer had no songs in it. Uh, it's supposed it's, to be a prequel. It doesn't say anything about whether or not it's tied into the other ones. It's going to be about how Willy Wonka enslaved the Oompa Loompas? And that he found them and, and yeah, enslaved. probably. Um, it's, to be, it's to be, it's called Wonka, I guess. And it's supposed to be released December 15th, 2023. Um, it stars, what is his name? Johnny um, Depp? No. Maya Angelou. Uh, the guy from Dune, bro. What's his name? Um, the, the kid white, from white, Dune. The white kid? Oh. Yeah. Um, uh, Tom Hardy. Char- Charlie oh. Chalamet. Timothy Chalamet. There you go. Tim- God bless Timothy. You. God, God bless Tim- you. Thank you. Uh, Timothy Chalamet will be uh, the new Wonka or Wonka um, I don't, for the I don't, prequel. I don't see it, but that's, that's fine. That's what they're going to do. It's not I my fault. Um, they also announced The Nun 2. Um, it had a teaser trailer that they did not release to the public as of yet, but those in attendance did. Uh, it is uh, to be released in theater September 8th. Um, blah, 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 blah. It is uh, the footage, what, segs into the trailer. I and, love segs. And will be, looks to be set in the 50s or early 60s. Um, so there they have that. As soon as they put some sort of trailer out for this movie, I will go ahead and put it on there. So um, goddamn time you put it on there. Uh, I, I do what I can. Um, I'm trying to do the announcements really quickly before we go back to the trailers. Um, Blue Beetle trailer we did already. Um, let's see. Where is, where is that guy? Um, uh, there it is. Uh, Aquaman 2 The Lost Kingdom obviously was announced. There's no public trailer as of yet. They did put a teaser for those in the attendance. Of I Cinemagon. love teasers. Um, it's set to be released December 20th, 2023. And I think we can go back to trailers now. Um, let's see. The next one is Meg to the trench make to the trenching the trenching yes the trenching and the three six ten forty four ninety and here we go well bam Ooh. hey can you see it nope i can hear it though yeah what just happened Yeah, my computer's doing all sorts of funky stuff. I love your little girls. I love them too. Yo, seriously? Do you do you see anything, or you don't? Are you? I don't see it. It's black. Okay, why don't you uh, make what? Did the Meg make a lot of money? Did you just unshare your screen? Did the Meg the Meg make a lot of money that it 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 warranted a sequel? Was that? Did it really? Did it really? Who knows, bro? Jason Statham, I guess, just needs money. I don't know. Who knows? That blade needs a little money. Bro, it is not. It is not coming up at all. I'm upset. Well, which means that, yay, we don't have to watch it. Okay. I got it now. Do you? Do yeah. You really? Let's, let's just hope that it works this time. Hello, Blue. Okay, can you see it? Yes. I see a dragonfly, I think. I'm not sure. I'm not going to look at that. Did you freeze? (laughs) 
Ladies and gentlemen, Mad Mad froze. Oh, <laughs> sorry. This is great. Oh my god. Um, I don't know what to do. We're still recording. Uh, so yeah, there was a show called Geek Girls, and it began with the Geek Girls. Uh, kidnapping Geek Bros at the time. It was myself and artist Hope for my note of Wancho. And the idea was that we were held in a little area and they were they took over and they did, a, uh, I think, a two-part special. And they, they actually liked it. And they liked it to a point that we decided to carry on with the show. And then, of course, you know, people get bored and then we rotate one, one co-host for another co-host and then it just dies off. Uh, we tried to revive it. Oh, I tried to revive it twice with two different casts, but uh, it didn't happen. And I was like, ah, whatever. But the Geek Girls, the, the the assets that were created for Geek Girls was actually pretty impressive. And it was really fun. It was really, really fun. Um, I think, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be a wrap because he's gone. <laughs> I'm going to go to bed because I'm tired. So, uh, Shame's promotion, that was Man Man. You can, you can find him. I think it's Man Fan, Man Man 125811. I don't even know. You can find me though, Vibro Studios, V I B E R E V S U D I O S. That's on Instagram, YouTube.com, Facebook, all that good stuff. The Geek Bros, myself and Man Man, you can find us on uh, Instagram and Twitter. That's Geek Bros with a zero, G E E K B R O zero S. That's also for TikTok. You can email us, Geek Bros with a zero at yahoo.com. Ask us questions, tell us a review shit. You know what? I dare you guys to send us the dumbest movies to review. We'll review it on the podcast. Uh, Facebook.com just keep Rose at a zero. And of course, you can listen to us on first place. You can listen to us first place. WeBeGeeksPC.com, where our audio is uploaded from there. And that's what you can find all the stuff there. Thank you, Mike. And of course, all future, no, past, present, and future Geek Bros content will be on YouTube.com slash at Geek Bros. Check it out. It's a lot of fun. That's it to keep it the Geek Bros podcast. And remember, geeking out still sounds this good. Keeping up with the Geek Bros.